really want hopefully the viewer to be alone and to walk like like in a philosophical experience, like in an, an atmosphere where the viewer is not thinking about time and, and anything else than the artworks that are here. The idea of the show comes from an incredible uh, artwork that Alberto Burri made in uh, Sicily in the 80s. The city of Gibellina was destroyed by an earthquake in 1968. He replaced the city that was destroyed with a huge cement, uh, uh, like an environment. So we, I had an idea to place a huge pedestal that looks like the same street, the same blocks, the same uh, idea of that piece. The Seven Sages is the most important piece and it's uh, at the core, at the, in, at the center of the exhibition. And it's totally a, a metaphysical piece and it's an homage to the Kiriko's mannequin. And uh, I really wanted the pedestal, or the city, because it's actually a city, to grow out of the Seven Sages' feet. Artworks around the, the Seven Sages, I, I see them like dancing motionless around them. I really wanted to show the heterogeneous artworks of Melotti, the variety of his different uh, approach and his different series. And, and I, in my mind, they are all dancing around the, the Seven Sages. I developed this kind of landscape where I added not only the ceramic but also the plaster bas relief. You can see the variety. Some of them are abstract, some of them are figurative, some of them are like single color, and some other are with the collage, with three di dimensional pieces. They are like fluid shapes that are floating and growing from the ground. I mean, people can think, okay, this is not the same artist, but actually he spent his whole life working like that. I mean, you, you need to experience, you need to see every single piece and see how many different types of, of, of inputs and of, of direction his work had in his life. Mm -hmm.